Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to flash the Samsung Captivate back to stock. I just ordered this one and it came with a custom ROM called Darky ROM and the SIM card will not read. So hopefully flashing it back to stock will fix this. Uh, I will provide all files associated with this, this video uh, attached to this post. First you want to download all files that I, I say you need to get, um, which is mainly the main one is just this Odin 3 one click downloader and uh, if necessary any of the drivers for your phone. You need to make sure your phone is recognizable by your computer. Um, let it either install the drivers by its, by its own self or to don't use the file that I provide. Once you have them open uh, or downloaded you can open the zip file for the Odin and unzip it. You will want to open the executable file that's in there Next you want to put your phone in download mode. There are two easy ways to do this. You can either press the volume down button and hold the power button at the same time. Or if your phone is off and disconnected from your computer, you can press both the up and down volume buttons and press and then connect the USB. And then you will get a screen that says, oops, I missed it. I'm pressing both of them, press them both in and, and click and you should get a screen that says download. There we go. That's the one we want. Okay. Easy enough. Now the only thing you want to do is make sure your computer recognizes it on Odin. It should say in yellow, highlighted, com, whatever port it should say. Mine says com 10. And all you need to do is click start. Um, you will let it run through its process and uh, you'll see your phone flashing into different modes and it will eventually reboot into the stock ROM.
and there we go it looks like everything's booting up with the stock ROM and everything on there now I just need to test to make sure the SIM card works now that everything is up and running again